Hey guys, another quick video for you. Uh, since the last video, if you watched it, I, I rearranged in here just slightly. I had this battery pack over here where that battery box is currently. Uh, it, it's pretty easy to move once, I mean, if you have all the tools. So I have been going to Harbor Freight. I picked up all this whole setup and I th uh, this, this uh, hoist was on sale. I think 180, 190, just picked that up. Uh, the leveler with a coupon. So that was around 30 bucks. And I've got some chains and got some uh, Harbor Freight straps. And, and I'm able to, to slide this thing around the shop in here. Uh, it's, it's really not too bad. But the uh, in case you're wondering, this thing is about 840 pounds. So if you ever do this, 840 pounds, you wanna make sure everything is uh, can, can handle that. The Tesla Model S and X packs, uh, those go around 1330, 1330 pounds from what I've heard. Uh, but I'm just making a quick video now because I wanted to show you the connections at this junction box in case you, you do this. So on this side, there are two small, I measured them, they're actually tapered and I can't find this fitting I don't really know what Tesla use or what, what they put in here, but um, this is about five eighths of an inch. So I'm gonna have uh, a, so my, my charger wires come out of here. And then on this side over here, this one is about one inch, just maybe slightly more. And I ordered a uh, two up cable to uh, come out of here and go to the car. And I have an Anderson SBX 350 uh, plug, two plugs that I'm going to uh, connect to the car. All right, so under here, it didn't come with the fuse or any of the hardware at all. So I went to Home Depot today, just uh, picked up a bunch of random nuts and bolts so I can figure out what size these all are, because I, I didn't see anything online because it's so rare. So this right here, the uh, it's a metric six uh, one, and that will work with, let's see, where is the camera? There it is. So that'll work with this one. It'll work with that, which this is the fuse holder. And yes, I can touch it because the uh, safety plug is removed. Then we have, uh, I really can't see this. We have one in here, and then this one here, and these are also the same uh, metric six one uh, screws. And then these are the main lugs for the main power wires coming in. And I don't have a metric eight. Uh, it almost takes, uh, what was this actually? It almost takes this whatever the American version is. So, but it looks like it's a metric eight. So I gotta pick, a, pick up a couple of those. And what's interesting is that the same metric six works with all of these that go all the way around the car or all the way around the battery pack. So what I'm going to do, instead of reusing the screws that I took out of this, which I, like I said in a previous video, they just didn't seem the strongest and they had been removed once before so I, I really wanted to make sure I had strong easily removable screws uh, in case I ever have to take the cover off again but this screws right in there so I'm gonna pick up a bunch more I haven't counted but it, it's it's a lot uh, so that's where I'm at and um, just thought I'd give you guys an update just in case any of you guys were actually interested uh, see you guys bye